We're here today to talk to Dr. Sanjay Kapoor about the importance of C-reactive protein. What does C-reactive protein tell us about heart disease? Well, C-reactive protein, which is also known as CRP, is known to increase when there is inflammation in the body. And inflammation has been linked with atherosclerosis by various different clinical research studies. Therefore, it has been suggested that testing for CRP levels in blood can help detect an individual's risk of getting a heart disease. What is high sensitivity CRP? Uh, well, there are two types of tests that can detect CRP levels in blood. Uh, one that detects very high levels of CRP, and the other one is a highly sensitive assay that detects very low levels of CRP, which is HSCRP. And very high levels of CRP are seen in cases of systemic inflammation, such as uh, rheumatoid arthritis or acute infections. However, very low increases in CRP levels, uh, which can be detected in a HSCRP test, the high sensitivity CRP test, are observed in case of vascular infl inflammation, uh, which has been linked with atherosclerosis. And atherosclerosis is a word which means formation of fatty deposits or plaques in the inner lining of arterial walls leading to heart disease, peripheral artery disease, or even stroke. And high levels of HSCRP may therefore be helpful in determining the overall risk of stroke or peripheral artery disease. And several different studies have shown that high levels of CRP, HSCRP, mean a higher risk of heart attack. What causes the vascular inflammation that results in high HSCRP levels? Uh, that's a good question. Uh, some of the major factors that can contribute to vascular inflammation include smoking, hypertension, hyperglycemia, and or even dyslipidemia. And people who do not exercise ha and have sedentary lifestyles may also have higher HSCRP levels. In patients with any of these conditions and or who are centrally obese uh, should be tested for CRP, uh, HSCRP levels. And if the levels are higher than 3 milligrams per DL, uh, then they should be retested to see if they have very high levels. And if the CRP levels are higher than 10 milligrams per DL, this could indicate non-cardiovascular causes of inflammation and those could include infectious diseases and even some autoimmune disorders or uh, even cancer. Thank you, Dr. Kapoor, for joining us today to talk about high-sensitive C-reactive protein. Thank you.